So this is the John Majeski Garden, which is located in the middle of the Victoria and Albert Museum, uh, named all, all and sundry as the v &A. So, And it's a very nice place to be, the garden, and the museum's worth a visit as well. I was actually, it was many years before I came here at first, because I thought it wouldn't really be my thing. You know, I'd imagine it full of old dresses and everything, but um, there's lots of really good stuff inside the museum, and it's well worth a visit. And the uh, garden is well worth a visit too, as you can probably see. Otherwise, I'm making a real hash of shoes in this. I'm not really full of fascinating facts about this place, um, the garden that is, because you know it's a garden with some lovely architecture around it and if you want somewhere to come and chill out and you're uh, somewhere around South Kensington station which is uh, the nearest tube station, um, it's basically just off the south end of Hyde Park um, and down a bit. So. Make sure as I walk around I don't actually end up in the lake, which might be seen as unprofessional. Pond maybe is better, because it's not very deep. Which I expect is quite handy, because certainly in the summer you can get sort of children running into it, so you wouldn't really want it to be deep in any way. So. Alright, uh, pause if you want to examine it, this is... Well, you may be watching it in 5K, but I'm shooting it in 5K. Worth checking out all the scenes just to blow the roof level. So this is the garden. Sorry, I'm walking backwards and being careful not to trip over the uh, sign saying what garden it is. Um, in the middle of the v &A. Oh, and um, you need to book a ticket at the moment, but actually I will confess that I walked past yesterday and asked them um, at what would usually be the main entrance, and they said, oh, you just go in um, the entrance around the side in Exhibition Road. So I came today and discovered, yes, but you need a ticket, which they forgot to mention yesterday. Um, but I just got my phone out, booked myself a ticket for um, about three minutes time because it was in five minute slots, which is free, though you can make a donation, um, and walked in. And it's not particularly packed, which is probably sort of obvious in the fact that you could just go bang with the ticket. I mean, it is sort of Thursday early afternoon, so I don't know how busy a time that is or not. And that is basically what you get. Sorry if I'm talking a little bit unevenly, but I'm walking backwards towards the door, which people enter here from, and so you've got to watch you don't trip over something and that somebody doesn't come through the door and knock you flying. But uh, if you've got a uh, camera that doesn't zoom and you want to zoom out, you've got to walk backwards. Anyway, here you are. I, uh, Hope you consider coming for a visit. There's lots of really good stuff inside the museum as well as the garden.